Hey everyone, welcome to AFS Hackers. I am Afshan, and in this video, we are going to learn the Social Engineering Toolkit. And uh, basically, Social Engineering Toolkit is an open source penetration testing framework designed for many custom attack vectors that allow us to make a believable attack quickly. This video is for educational purpose, so please don't use this particular tool to harm anybody. Okay so for starting the social engineering toolkit and it is basically it is pre-installed in kali linux so i just have to write se toolkit so this is the command that is se toolkit enter as you guys can see it is created by david and it is it is a product of trusted sec right it is easy to update using the pen tester framework ptf and here is the github profile and it is a very easy to understand framework okay so here is the menu right uh, the first is social engineering attack second one is penetration testing fast track third one is third party modules fourth one is update the social engineering toolkit uh, fifth one is update set configuration and number six we have help credits and about and 99 is exit the social engineering toolkit so i'm gonna go with one that is social engineering attack and we have 10 different option okay first is spear phishing attack vector website attack vector infectious media generator uh, create a payload and listener mass mailer attack and and so on i'm gonna go with the second option that is website attack vector we have different options and we are going to perform this credential harvester attack method so credential harvester method is used when you don't want to specifically get a shell uh, but perform a phishing attack to obtain username and password from the system so i'm gonna write three and we have three options webs web template site cloner or custom import so we are going to clone the site the second method will completely clone a website of your choosing and allow you to utilize the attack vector within the completely same web application you were attempting to clone so let's write two ip address for the post back in harvester i'm leaving this as it is set support both http and https so we'll go with the facebook.com that is facebook.com i'm cloning this website that is facebook.com okay cloning the website http login.facebook.com okay and the best way to use this attack is if username and password from fields are available and the credential harvester is running on port 80 so just new tab and you have to write the ip address by using if config we can see that and here is my ip address let me copy it and i'm opening the firefox so write the ip address and port 80 so it is working fine okay i can access it and uh, and it is a marathi language that's that facebook madhya pravesh kara uh, let log into the facebook and here it is asking me the email or phone number and here is a password and login kara means just click on the login button so i'm writing so this is my email address i'm writing I am dark shadow i at gmail.com and the password is dark shadow and I'm logging in. Don't save. After that, it is redirecting me to the Facebook login page. Now, let's see if we get the credential 
and here you can see that possible username field is i am dark shadow i at gmail.com and here is the password that is dark shadow so yes we have successfully got the credential you can use that this link to in the mass miller attack okay but the mass mirror attack it's not working like we cannot send the email because google has stopped supporting the secure less secure app feature so that is the reason we are unable to perform the mass mirror attack but you can use this link in the, in the email and you can get the username and password like this so that's it for this video guys i hope you like it if you did then please share this video with your friends and your colleagues who are learning about penetration testing and yes make sure that you guys are subscribing to my youtube channel we'll see you in my next video till then take care and keep learning Bye bye